Hi everyone, so I am going to be doing my makeup for work. I am working at home, so this is what I would do when I used to go to work. And I'm hoping one day very soon things will go back to normal, but for now things are not normal and they won't be for a while. So this is the makeup I do for work. Or if I have like Zoom calls that are really important, usually I don't wear makeup, but I did get this requested. So it's just a very light, natural, fresh look that I do. So let's get started. I am just going to use this, it's the Healthy Skin Neutrogena Foundation. And I just put like a little bit, I don't overdo it or anything. I just take a dot like that and I will just try to make sure that it spreads evenly. Yeah, this foundation is super light, but it has good coverage but it looks just like your skin, which is why it's starting to become, if not it is, my favorite drugstore foundation. And I must say, I took this foundation with me to Disney World and it lasted all day. So back when things were normal. <laughs> also just blend it down your neck. But I just go in with my concealer and fix that. Or I just use the excess product. And now I'm going to go in with concealer. So I use the LA Girl Pro Concealer. And I'm just going to... This one's new. I just got this. Well, this is a new bottle. I've used this before, but... It's all nice and clean. It's a little light for me. So I just take a little bit of a dot and then just a, just a tad bit down the nose and that's just to brighten it up. So, don't ever like overdo it on the concealer, especially if you have like dark circles because it enhances it for whatever reason. So that's all I need brightens up the face. I like to make sure that the concealer goes in an upwards angle because that way it pulls up the eyes. I already have almond shaped eyes so it just brightens them up a little bit more. So that is the skin all fresh. The next thing I do to keep it light and natural is I use a liquid I use a liquid blush and this is the Grande Pop Plumping Liquid Blush. This is in the color it's called Tiramisu. So I'm just going to pop this right on the cheeks before we set because then it's not going to blend right. So I just take a few dots. And I use another damp sponge and just blend in. And it, it gives you more of a natural glow, which I like. So once we're done with that, I just take my Fenty powder and I'll just set everything. I do put a little bit of airspun under the eyes just because I really like that nice and set, but not too much. I'm not baking because this is more of a natural look. I do want that glow, so I just keep it there. And then I take my Fenty Beauty powder and I will just go over everything. So it doesn't take away the color of the blush but of course we will be going in there with powder blush just to make sure that we don't lose that color i just use my wet n wild retractable brow pencil and just do my brows real quick
Okay, the next palette I use, which is my favorite everyday palette, the Too Faced Sweet Peach. I am going to be using the color in here. It's called Luscious. And I'm going to place that all over my lids. I combine Luscious and Nectar and then Peaches and Cream, I will put that on my brow bone. But you'll see me doing all this. to put some right here as well it's all on my finger right now I have to be careful right here because I have a vein that comes down in my eye and when I put um, highlight it it emphasizes it I don't know why okay up next is lips and this work look will be complete Okay, the lip color I am going to be wearing is Charlotte Tilbury's lip color in Pillow Talk, which is one of my favorite lip liners for naturalness. It really needs to be sharpened. Do I have a sharpener anywhere? Yes, I do, yay. to do is add a little bit of a nude color this is the lot lit this is the live glam lipstick it's so cute it has like little ka-ching ching stuff on it in the color it's called royalty I'm just gonna add like a dab in the middle I just spread it Okay, so that is exactly how I like my makeup for work or for Zoom meetings when I want to look presentable. Very minimal and just light pop of color on the lips and on the cheeks, but very minimal eyes. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I will see you on my next video. Thank you guys for the requests and yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye guys.